Bom, pessoal, Rebedi aqui. Hoje a gente estava na coletiva de imprensa com um deles. É a primeira vez no Brasil, como todo mundo sabe. Uma turnê super extensa, que começa nos próximos dias aí. Vai passar por várias cidades. A gente vai deixar todos os detalhes para vocês. É... Agora a gente vai simplesmente aproveitar o Denis, a oportunidade de estar aqui pessoalmente com a lenda do Iron Maiden. É, perguntar quais são as expectativas dele para esses shows e é basicamente isso a cobertura vai estar no nosso canal na sequência bom basicamente eles thank you very much for your attention today thank you thank you us, thank you very uh, much the media the fans are expecting uh, the concert for too long yeah. and it's a great opportunity to have you in Brazil so Basically, uh, simply, what are your expectations with the Brazilian public? Uh, what do you hope to achieve uh, at this concert? And what songs could we expect on these first shows in Brazil? Well, yeah, first of all, I think everyone knows the fact that we were coming here in 2020. Uh, that everyone was really looking forward to that. And, I, and uh, unfortunately, we all know that uh, that was cancelled, postponed, and the whole world came to a standstill and a stop from COVID. Um, I was just praying that uh, we would get another chance to come here. Um, we've got that chance now. Uh, finally, we're here, 2023. Um, um, looking at uh, videos and uh, documentaries on Maiden in South America, especially Brazil, is that it's just unbelievable, it's amazing. And uh, the following that, that, that my maiden have here is, is incredible. And um, as I've said many, many times, I, I've done this show throughout Europe and everywhere, Scandinavia, around the world. And um, everywhere we go, we're, 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 we're given a really warm welcome from the maiden family from different countries. Um, I've yet to uh, prove to be accepted in the Maiden family in Brazil, but hopefully once uh, you come to the show, they come to the show, once they've seen us play, once they've seen what goes on, uh, hopefully I will be welcomed into the Brazilian Maiden family with open arms, because it's taken a long while for us to, to get here. Um, the show, as I've said many times before again, uh, in Europe, it was always a shorter set because uh, the bands I work with like to do a 45 minute set on their own to, to show their maiden skills off from different albums from, from the tours and from the years. Uh, in Brazil, um, I'm doing a longer set. We're adding more songs from the first two albums and some other little bits and pieces that will be surprises. So. Yeah, as I said, you know, we've come this far, we're here now, and we need to, we need the fans to come to the shows and, and support us, and um, make this trip a dream come true that I've been looking forward to. So, that's what I hope. Thank you very much. Uh, of course, it will be a blast. The concerts will be there on Sunday. Yeah, yeah. Então, pessoal, comigo a gente está aqui em São Paulo, o vídeo completo vai acontecer logo mais. Yeah. Uh, thank you very much for your time. No it's problem, any time. And I'm looking forward to Sunday. And any questions, yeah, any of you guys coming at the show, just come and see me. Ask me anything, and uh, I'm there. So come and see the show. You won't be disappointed. Fantastic. It will be a dream come true to all these Stratton fans beyond their meaning. Yeah, well, for sure. Please yeah. yeah, and hopefully, if it goes really well, there could be something in the future. Who oh, knows? Nice. We just have to keep our hands folded and pray that it's going to be a fantastic show. You know that. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Valeu, pessoal.